Hey guys and welcome to Where's the Scale. So what I love about our community is that people often tell me about the new and upcoming tools that I have never would have found myself. And today we are looking into the Human Writer, which is at humanwriter.com, which is a, essentially a completely free AI tool that needs only your Open Playground API key, and that's it. And so this tool is uh, making some bold claims. So full article from one keyword, unique SEO optimized articles, uses more SEO ranking factors. I have no idea what these are. You can upload directly to cloud properties, push content to WordPress sites and get access for free, which we will do. And again, this is the comparison <laughs> in favor of human writer, of course. So user friendly, fully optimized. And as far as you can tell, these two can uh, create websites as well. OK, and this is the owner. I have not been in contact with him, so I don't know the background of this guy, to be quite honest. So let's take a look. And uh, you do need your open API key, which you insert here. And then you have uh, two options. Uh, as of now, you have single articles and multiple articles. Unfortunately, no standard sites, no local sites. You can't manage clients. These are all coming soon. And I would actually assume that you cannot. Oh, you can push to WordPress. Oh, OK, so this one is working. Nice. So you can actually directly upload to WordPress. And this is presumably working right now. And you have a pretty amazing 2000 per uh, articles per month limit. But again, you're using your own API key. So what I did, I have generated uh, four articles uh, and you can see the costs. So 50 cents, 60 cents, 30 cents and 26 cents. And uh, if you go to single articles, you have a few options. So I was generating articles on canned oxidlongan as per usual. Then you can insert your headings, maximum of 20, which is good. Then you can add FAQs and then you have advanced options. So I chose GPT-4 for all the, my generations. You can add bullet points either to one section. Then content length, I actually left it a 2000. I left language and tone as defaults. Uh, then you uh, can insert your SEO and slash LSI keywords. You can generate headings from keywords. You can avoid AI detection. And this is what I did for the first two generations. And uh, there is a disclaimer that says that output quality might be lower. And you have th these three neat boxes. So you can, you can create a custom prompt that applies to headings, then to the content as a whole, and then the FAQs. And if you choose the AI detection, then you have a fourth prompt that would apply to AI detection as well. Having said that, these are the four articles, and I will be, I will be measuring SEO score and AI detection slash readability. So this was the first article uh, that I got. Uh, and you get your Slack, your meta title, and your meta description as well. So very, very handy. And you have your FAQs. And this article is not SEO optimized, meaning that I did not include any additional LSI keywords, which I did for other generations. So let's just see what it is. And it's properly formatted. You get your H2s and H3s. And this is a, and I, I don't see the word count anymore because NeuroWriter has, oh, okay, words. Almost 3,000 words and an SEO score 52, which is below average, I would say, because the best score is 69. And uh, this is a wall of text and some pros and cons, but I don't see anything here. Maybe, maybe uh, you could use special prompts to say, I want bulleted lists and tables and bolded words. And while we are at it, while I'm recording this whole thing, let me do just that. A new single article. Can docs it longer. And I won't be doing uh, any SEO optimizations for this article. I just want to test one particular feature. So GPT-4, headings from keywords. And the keyword is going to be can docs. It's long end. And what I want to do, additional prompt for headings, additional prompt for content. So use bolded words, lists, and tables, as well as good natured 
humor and personal anecdotes. And for the tone of voice, um, where is the tone of voice? Tone of voice, oh, these are defaults. Uh, oh, let's be casual. So we will, we will be generating this and I will tell you the main reason for this later. So article number one, 52 SEO. Let's check readability and air detection. So this was the air detection applied. And this is 20% regional, so 80% AI. Let's look at plagiarism, nothing. Readability, 32, and the average is between 31 and 62, so this is a lower threshold. So I would say the readability is quite low, but we will take an out of this, so 32 and 20 and 52. Okay, next. And the next uh, article is actually SEO optimized. And we still, um, I still chose the AI detection feature, but I also included the LSI keywords. And I deleted the H1. Okay. And the, the score is immediately 62, so a much better score. Let's copy this article, let's feed it back to originality. So once again, the ACL score jumped from 52 or 55, I forget, to 62. And this is 44 original, okay. Zero plagiarism, readability is 38, so we got a better readability for some reason, but that's good. Now for the third article, I actually use an outline, a custom outline. So I still did use the SEO keywords, but I applied a custom outline, which I took from Agility Writer. Let's see if this improves our score. Wow. <laughs> oh my God, so it jumped to 81. Let's see if this still passes AI detection. 47 original, two plagiarized, and 53 readability, so a much better readability. Nice. Maybe this is because of the custom outline. And finally, I decided to ditch AI detection to see if the readability improves, but I also fed that special prompt without the LSA keywords. So we will just check SEO for fun, but I'm more interested in readability. So this generation is without the LSA keywords but uh, it should be more readable. 65 SEO, okay, so a very good result still, but I'm more interested, as I said, in readability. And actually, guys, uh, I've just remembered, uh, I tried to use the special prompt that prompts the human writer to use lists and tables in bolded words, and unfortunately, I don't see any. So maybe this feature is um, is under development, but uh, so far it didn't work. And 96% original, so maybe this <laughs> prompt of mine did do something because I said something about good nature, humor, and personal anecdotes. And readability is 65, so okay. For some reason it did not affect the formatting, but it did improve readability and the AI detection score. Wow. Okay, so this is pretty interesting. I would still see this as a wall of text, but uh, for the money, <laughs> which uh, there isn't any, uh, that you pay, uh, quote unquote, so this is a pretty good tool. You can uh, do bulk generations. This uploads to WordPress directly, and you only pay uh, what you pay for the API key. So that was it. Hopefully you found this video helpful. Go check out Human Writer, test it out. Let me know what you think and uh, I'll see you next time.